Three new or two. On one card is a picture of an excellent food. On the other card is the not so excellent version of that food. With each round, one person gets to peek at what's on their card. Then the other person without knowing what's on either card gets to decide if they want to renew or two, swap their card or keep their card. We'll reveal the cards and take a bite. Yeah, okay. Now I get to look at my card and then Ricky gets to decide based on my face. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and renew. I would like to swap with Jamie and I'm sure that was part of her plan all along. <laughs> oh goodness gracious. Oh my, oh how fun. oh gross, oh gosh. Jamie, what do you have on your card? I have chocolate covered grasshoppers. Oh wow, Here's I have lunch. Keebler grasshopper cookies. My ingredients are mint and fudge. This oh. sounds delicious. Mine's just grasshopper and chocolate syrup. <laughs> mm. All right, boom, you wanna, you wanna get this crunch? I think it's gonna be pretty crunchy. Okay, here we go. Oh, I mean, it's, it's not great, <laughs> but um, it kind of tastes like chocolate and then dog food, maybe expired dog food. <laughs> Cause it's not like, hey, Rover, I want you to eat that. It's <laughs> like, I don't know, Rover, <laughs> you should have eaten that. Okay, so why all this talk about chewing? Check this out while I clean grasshopper out of my teeth. Anybody have floss? Have you ever had a really negative thought that you just can't kick? Negative thoughts can be such a disruption to our lives because what you think affects how you feel and how you feel affects the things that you do. Man, there are so many negative thoughts that we can have throughout our entire day. Sometimes when I was a kid, I used to have negative thoughts like no one liked me or that I wasn't cool enough or that I didn't have really great friends. And if you have those thoughts, it's okay. But the thing is not to really dwell on them. So one thing that you can do when you have negative thoughts that you really can't seem to get out of your head is to renew and chew. You renew your mind. You pray. You think about all the wonderful things that God has done for you, all the scriptures that he has given you to memorize. So when you feel like you're not good enough, guess what? God says that you are fearfully and wonderfully made. I like to think of some thoughts like birds flying over our heads. So you can't stop a bird from flying over your head, but you sure can stop a bird from building a nest in your hair. Negative thoughts can come and they're not sins, but when you want to renew your mind, you need to go to scripture to combat those negative thoughts. So remember, renew and chew. If it always feels like you have trouble finding anything good to think about, be sure to tell someone. Reach out to a trusted adult and let them know you need some help.